Hi everyone, this is Lensmanos here and welcome to another episode of New Age. This is episode 14. Um, I went and raided what I think was the Greasy Geeks base. Um, did a nether run, got a few things. Uh, you can see here we've got a lot of stuff sitting in the chest now. Some lots of cool stuff, there's plenty of iron. Some more ores. Um, bunch of materials here that... Um, Pretty sure it was a Crazy Geek's base. Correct me if I'm wrong. A um, bunch of stuff here that was just sitting over there. A little bit disappointed with this chest in that it, it, it sort of sorts, but it doesn't. Um, so we will need to get into a better better setup here, and that spider's going to annoy me. Come on, buddy. Where are you? How are you doing? Tough spider. Is that all you, you and your friends? Any more friends down here? No? We're good? Alright, still got the doubled up um, NPCs. But we may end up going and breaking Greasy Geek's um, Yule of Sut. I don't know whether that'll work. Are you in my house? Hey, Jim, this is my house. Okay, thanks Jim. Alright, this episode, what I was thinking about doing was starting down a path of some sort of automated mining and farming and that sort of stuff because while we've got these here, they're alright, um, and harvesting manually is fine. I'm, Kind of, um, I think I'm kind of tapped out on Harvest Festival at the moment. I don't believe Yulaf has any more things that I can buy. And today's Saturday, the only day he doesn't work. Well done. Thanks, Yulaf. Um, so, what I was thinking, oh, I crafted myself a bag of holding. Uh, it's just some gold ingots, a couple of oak chests, magical wood, which is a bookshelf and a piece of gold. So, pretty cheap. Um, and I use that to um, bring the items from the Greasy Geeks house. If if that was it, I'm, it could have been Dragon Breaths. I'm not sure. Whoever's house that was, um, I stole all your stuff. Not that it matters, single player. Right. So what I was thinking, this pack has progressive automation. Now, if you're watching my um, my family Let's Play series, you'll have seen some of this before. I think I've got the planter and the chopper. Um, I wouldn't mind looking into some of the like the generator and the miner. The miner would be cool. I, I, uh, let's think. Um, no, this one will be out after that episode. Sorry, I've, I'm trying to get a little bit ahead during because of the Christmas period. Um, I've set up a a miner on uh, in the um, in the family series. Who are you? Abby. Hello, Abby. Okay. Um, I've set up a, a miner, so you might have seen that already. But what I plan to do here, we've got these other things. We've got an animal, animal farmer. And there's this killer thing, but that might be good for a mob farm at some point. Um, but I thought... I don't know what the crafter does. Let's start by putting... A chopper together. I, I wouldn't mind just going straight for iron. I think I might have enough iron to do this. So let's look through and then we'll work out a nice little place to put it. Um, downside to it is the iron one is that we'll need iron upgrades which will require stone upgrades which will require wood upgrades. Um, let's just start with wooden chopper. So I need to make a furnace. Alright, and we need to make a wooden. Really? Need some sticks. Uh, so the only problem with this um, is that I can't just drop things, you know, like in an AE system, you can just shift click things back into this. 
It doesn't work like that on this big chest. So I want to make one of them. And then I want to make... I have no idea where all this stuff came from. Oh, perhaps I... Oh, okay. I want it to go in there. I want it to go in the chest. Would be fantastic. Alright, anyway. Um, <laughs> things being what they are. There we go. In you go. Back in the chest. Get in there. Uh, so, sorry about that. Do I have a chest? I do. That's a wooden chopper. Can we make it a stone one? We're going to need a stone axe. Like that. Let's make a stone chopper. Um, you know what? We might leave it at that for now. Um, and what I want to do is we'll get it we'll get it started with like I can make four upgrades. I'm gonna need some more wood. We'll get it started with four. Do I have any other like andesite or Yep. Any more? Awesome. That's one way to clear out some of the inventory. I wish the sorting enabled things to stack together. Um, okay, so th that'll give us four upgrades. I don't think I can make any more. Oh, hang on. Why is that doing that? That's odd. Alright, so we've got eight upgrades. Uh, what sort of saplings do we have in here? I have to do this the other way. Saplings, saplings. Who's got the saplings? Got some birch. Is that all we have? Flowering oak. Got this mer meryl, whatever that is. Oh, we've got some oak. Um, what's going to be better? Oh, we'll go with oak. So let's find a spot. I'm actually thinking like just out here. Um, and placing it down at like this. Actually, what level does it need to be? I think it's just on top of the ground, isn't it? Um, so he can have some of them. And we can give him some of that. And I'm going to need some fuel, a chest for the stuff to go into, and stone axe. So let's go and make, uh, we may be able to just get away with the obligatory tinker's stone hatchet. A tool rod. Um, so what do we need for a hatchet? Just, it, it's a, okay. Part builder, let's get one of these and an axe head and we'll get some wood for a tool rod or a stick or something. Might work. Uh, let's see. It's not quite in order anymore. No, not. No, I need to actually make. I do have the tool rod pattern. Really? Okay. I didn't want to throw that on the ground. Okay, so it takes one wood to do this now. I can't just use a stick anymore. I want to make a hatchet. Just a basic clumsy one. Let's get some coal. Yeah, we'll just take this stack. I'll head on out. I kind of want him to clean up this area too. So, you need some fuel and you need an axe. Again, as I said, I'm not sure what sort of area he's going to work in. Let's put some more dirt down. Um, 
shopping. Not sure where he's shopping. Might go and find my lumber axe. No, oh, he's clean up. Clean up everything that's above him. That's cool. Still might get my lumber axe. Uh, I got a hatchet. I do have a lumber axe somewhere, don't I? Or did I break it? Or is it just sorted? There it is. It's just sorted weird. Get rid of these trees. Clear the area up a little bit. Really need um fast leaf decay. Don't think it's on this pack. Correct me if I'm wrong, I mean things are coming down pretty quick. Anyway, um so yeah, we get the, the chopper going. So that should get us some more wood, which is something we're going to need. It's going to use it'll reuse itself. If I didn't have the chest here, it would it would go until it ran out of space inside. Must be a beehive. Oh yeah, that'll sting me if I stay around too long. So let's get rid of this stuff. Get the sword's probably quicker. So that's our chopper. I put the the eight upgrades in it, which should give us all sides. Um, and we'll do some more upgrades eventually and spread it out a bit. Oh, one of the other things I did while I was over at the other base was take I had a couple of hoppers in the chest. So I've just hooked this up so it's automated. There's a hopper under each of these tables. Um, so that's cool. Right. So that's that running. I'm just going to put that in there for now. Um, yeah, let's take that. We'll go and sleep. And then I think I want to work on farming, but I also want to work on a way of powering them, because obviously we can use the RF engine here, which isn't that expensive, but we need to power it somehow. Uh, this does have a generator. I don't know how this works. We can check it out, perhaps. I don't know what it produces in the way of power. Otherwise, we'll make a um, another one of these. I mean, this is pretty good. 400 RF a tick. Um, cabling things out there could be interesting. Uh, worst case, we could use wireless RF powering through um, extra utilities. That's possible. Uh, let's have a look. The other thing I wanted to do was make the f farmer, but as I said, the planter, I should say. As I said, I want to make sure we've got the ability to power it. So what have we got? Conduit. Got Ender IO power conduits, which probably isn't that hard to make. Uh, we've got the the calculator wireless RF system I guess perhaps I'm not sure if it's in 110 um, so we could probably make some of this you know, let's let's try it let's try and make just regular conduits wow Not a lot of stuff in here I don't know how many that's gonna make do we have oh I probably don't have I need to make an alloy smelter so let's make three of them. Cauldron. Whoops. No, I don't want the decoration one. I don't need some gold nuggets. Do I have gold in here? Should have gold nuggets. Let's make one of them. 
Need some iron bars. Machine chassis. Alloy smelter. So that's cool. We can use the alloy smelter. Now let's let's pick him up. Cool, you're getting power. Just gonna put him there for now. Let's see if we can get some redstone and some iron. How much redstone have we got left? Probably chewed through a fair bit of it. Iron, there's some. We mind um what do I want to do here? How many do I want? Let's go with twelve. Right, we twelve of them. Get rid of some of the stuff. Um, is that conduits made up? We've got twelve of them, and I'm out of power. Uh, power. Need some power. Get the lignite. Maybe that'll burn in there. Yep. Cool. Burn away, my friend. We can at least get three of these. We'll get some cabling, and then we'll um. What we want to do? We can make the uh the end IO generator, or I I do want to make this progressive automation one just to see what it's like. So let's start with a wooden generator. We're going to need a couple of blocks of redstone because we're going to need one of these, two of these doohickeys. So let's one, two. I need one for the generator, so we're going to need another block. We're going to need another furnace. So it's a wooden generator. I don't know what it produces, but let's let's go straight up to to stone. Oh, I really not have any stone. It's just like smelt two more. Uh, what do we got here? Okay, that's enough to make some conduits. I don't know if this will actually um, produce enough to, to use this. So I'll put them away for the moment. Um, right. Stone generator. Just missing those two bits of stone. All right, so we've got a stone generator. Let's make the planter. We're going to need a wooden hoe, another furnace. We need another stick. Really? Excellent, let's just make 16 sticks. Wooden planter. It's that. Wooden. Not going to have enough for the stone, am I? All right, do I not, not have andesite or anything? Some nickel. Okay, no, that's cool. What I do with the cobble? So we'll throw a few more in here. Um, let's see. So do I want to keep it over here? Just have little basic farms next to each other? Or, because I mean then we, then we could power it off the same system. Hmm. I mean this isn't permanent. Because we will probably move it at some point. But, um. Kinda. You know what? 
Let's put it over here where these farms actually are. I'm gonna dig. I want to go one, two, three in. One, two, three. It needs to go there. So, the planter will need to go here. Um, let's do this. Let's put. I'm going to need a chest. And that stone that I cooked up. Stone. So let's make the stone planter. One of them. It's a stone planter. I'm going to require a chest. It's oak wood. No, birch wood will do. I've got virtual chests, so let's not do that. Let's take one of them. And let's see. Oh, I'm going to require one more of these, aren't I? I need some gold. I think I've got some outside. Yep, got that from smelting down some of the. the whatever it is, the pour ore or the. Forget which, what it's called. One of them. This stuff can go back in this chest. Uh, weed or sell. Alright, let's go and check it out. So, put it under here. Should be able to put the planter. There, that's the generator. Well done, well done, Lens. Planter. Um, so I can probably put chest. Maybe you know we won't even use the cables. Let's let's put that in there. Forty arrow for tick. That's it's not that bad. Alright, let's get some more, um, uh, well, a tool. Let's make. Let's make. Shovel pattern. And. One of them. And I need some cobble. Cobble. Just throw it away, why don't you? Shovel head. Yep. Axe head. Yep. Sweet. One of them. Thank you much, Lee. Probably didn't bring any fuel with me. That's cool. Let's get in here. Throw that in. Hey, that runs too. We can uh, chop up all these little bits of wood that are floating around here and burn them. Burn them all! Uh, we'll get some better power for it though. What else have we got in like coal? Uh, I got some little bit of lignite. Gonna have to do another mining run, I think. Very much out of out of things to um, to use, so I'm gonna need to mine. Um, yeah. Some wood. So are you working? Got some lettuce. Can we put lettuce in here? No. We planted. So he's only got a range of one, so I'm going to need to make another eight upgrades. Whoopsie. 
much wood do you have? Not enough. Not enough at all. Hence why I needed the chopper. Because we need more wood to make upgrades for our automated machines. Uh, let's see. Whoops, that was a cherry tree. Oh well, can't do much now. It's gone. Let's get back to base and sleep. And we're getting pretty close to wrapping up points. So I want to get this farm working efficiently. Well, more efficiently, I should say. Um, so I want maybe five. What else can you do? the eight I need. I need lots and lots of stone. Alright, give me a tick. I'm going to go do a quick mining run and when I come back we'll get this um, this thing upgraded a little and um, we'll be able to do some some farming I guess. So give me a second. Okay, did a bunch of mining. Trusty hammer for the win. Uh, let's make some of these. Excellent. And then let's throw the other junk that I just picked up while mining into the chest. So that should now have a range of 9. So it's going to mine this circle, or this square. Um, as I said, again, not the best. Uh, I'll probably go at least another, probably another 25 upgrades, and then it'll give us a, a nice square here, but we'll be in the wall. Uh, and we'll need to work out a way of making things wet here for. Um, Use? I don't know if that's actually able to output. I know in a multiplayer series it was able to output. Okay, so that was able to output to there, but we'll, it's obviously not going to output to the side. Um, right, so that's a bummer. Probably going to need to work out a way of getting items into this. Hopper would be enough. And just burnt all the uh, fuel that it had. This this has got forty thousand RF. So that is very cool. So I'm going to leave it there. We'll wrap up the episode at this point. Let me know what you thought. Just a little bit of basic automation. I'm probably going to move this out a bit, or um, actually I probably will. I'll probably bring it out a tad and get rid of a little bit of this um, tiering of this area um, to get some better farms running. Uh, just something a little bit more automated. I mean, uh, okay, the food I've produced there isn't amazing. A little bit of lettuce. But, um, you know, these things can change. We can uh, put some different items in there. Uh, chopper, on the other hand, possibly is working. And it's actually gaining XP. That's cool. That's um, very cool. Let's see if we got some bone meal. We'll just double check that. Do I have bone meal in here? A junk in my inventory, but do I have bone meal or bones? Should have some bones. There's some. Let's just 
So we'll grab a couple. Um, I'll put that in there. Fuel pellets. Cool. Okay, let's just really quick. So, we've got 9 and 4, 59. It's got an XP of 19. Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Are you working? I don't believe I used it. I'm pretty sure I made that. Made it from scratch, so it shouldn't have had any XP on it. Or did I use it to chop some of the trees the other way? I probably used it to chop trees the other way. Is that that would be cool though? Oh, it is. It is getting nice. That is excellent. So this will level up. That'll mean this uh, matic over here. Yes, it's got an XP as well. Oh, that's awesome. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Please leave those comments in the section below. Let me know what you thought of the video. Give me some suggestions for the upcoming ones. Uh, Main Freak has left a few suggestions on the previous episode, uh, which I will try and work my way into. His suggestions were uh, a bit of mechanism, uh, perhaps some environmental tech, which before I start environmental tech, I think I need a lot more lapis and a bunch more gold before I um, start being able to make some of the required items. But um, yeah, we've got still got a fair bit of stuff to do. There's more mods in here than than you know you expect from the start. It's not a huge pack, but it's got some pretty nicely um, tied in mods. So we've got some stuff here I've never never tried before. Obviously I've tried progressive automation before so it's not new but um, environmental tech is so that will be um, something we'll give a go to. Try and break this tree out of here. Excellent. Um, yep yeah, so lots to do. Thanks for watching. See you in the next episode.